Hey man, say man, it's your boy Zabo TV back with another video. Do you can't fuck a favor? Scroll down, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell. That way you know when you're notified when I'm dropping videos. Also hit the like button because that'll help my video get out to the YouTube universe. Comment, tell you can't fuck what you think about this video and this channel. But everything here is Atlanta based stuff. If it ain't music or entertainment, it's Atlanta everything. But anyway, let's get into the video. So today's video is about the Atlanta Falcons. So we know that someone got hurt. Our quarterback number two, quote unquote, he wasn't my quarterback number two. But with all due respect, AJ McCarron, that guy that used to play for Alabama, who came in the league and became a bum. All right. This is no disrespect to AJ McCarron, but he tore his ACL. How do I see? In the game against the Miami Dolphins, we are down to two quarterbacks on the roster on a depth chart. So now, Arthur Smith has to scramble to get another guy at least in the uniform because the season starts in a few weeks. You just got a lot of bums out there. So, what do you do? When life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. So, my boy Arthur Smith brought along Josh Rosen. That's right. Former first round pick, top draft pick, Josh Rosen. Cliff Kingsbury, he didn't even want the guy. So he wanted to bring on his guy, which was Kyler Murray. He knew him from Texas Tech. So he brings Kyler Murray over. How come he don't want me, man? Kick my boy to the curb, goes to Miami. Misused, mishandled at uh, Miami. Kick him to the curb, they brought in Tua. So in this situation, I think it would be great for him to be coming to Atlanta due to the fact that Matt Ryan is a veteran. You can learn against, well, not only learn against, but you can learn from a great quarterback like Matt Ryan. I know a lot of people don't like Matt Ryan. Like I told y'all folks, this is my first year. I'm not going to judge Matty Ice. He's my quarterback and he will be a Hall of Famer, whether we like it or not. That being said, I think being in Atlanta could help this young man at least be a nice backup in the league from years to come. If he's not our backup, he could be a backup for somebody else down to come. I think worst case scenario, this guy could at least be a Fitz Magic. But he's a young guy, I think he could learn a lot from Matty Ice. Also, it'll be nice to see that competition between him and Felipe Franks. I think Felipe Franks should be our quarterback too. Yeah, he's young and he didn't look that good, but that was the most football he's played this whole season. So that being said, I think the Falcons are in a good spot. Another thing that just came out also today, Javian Hawkins has got cut from the team. Yes, yes, yes. I know a lot of people are upset and like, what the hell? Why did we draft Javion Hawkins? Well, we didn't draft Javion Hawkins. He was an undrafted free agent. Um, he's a speedster, man. Once he played that foot in the ground, he's gone, man. He has breakaway speed and I thought he would be great and useful in this offense. But the Atlanta Falcons thought otherwise. Javion Hawkins, keep your head, homie. Hey, man, somebody gonna pick you up, man. You got some football left in you, kid. No gap. But that being said, the roster is getting shorter, 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 shorter. A lot of people think the next person that may be getting cut is Christian Blake. The official roster cut down is coming up soon. You know, Zabo TV, I'm gonna keep y'all updated with all the facts. But this was a quick video to keep y'all updated what's going on with the Atlanta Falcons. This is your boy Zabo TV. Please like, comment, subscribe to the channel. I'm out.